guys, I'm Brittany Rivers and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be reviewing this 5x5 closure wig from Wig My Hair. They reached out to me wanting me to review this wig. So I have a lot to say. So before we get into this video, I'm going to ask that you all remember to like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Madam Brittany. I'm going to link the hair in the description box. And let's go ahead and get into this video. You guys, this is Wig My 5x5 HD Lace Closure Wig. So, I had never really heard of 5x5 closures. Y'all really put me on. Like, some of you all would be like, oh, I'm just going to get the 5x5. Like, I've heard of 6x6 and I've heard of 4x4, but really, I never really heard of a 5x5. And this is also their HD Lace. So, let me get close so you all can see this lace. But you all see, I could kind of side part it over there or something if I wanted to. So a five by five closure, basically, where does it stop? It stops right here. So it goes from temple to temple. And if you have like a more narrow head, then it's probably even like back here. But I added little baby hairs over here. So this is my first five by five closure ever. I really love how far it can go back, the parting space, like, my thing is I absolutely love a long middle part and having a lot of parting space also helps if you're doing a side part. So you could kind of get a side part in with this without shifting it over. So look right there or something. But if you want it like a deeper side part, you will probably have to shift the wig over. Um, you all definitely put me on cause I haven't really even like checked into five by five lace closures. So in the um, box, it came with some lashes, you all. A little headband wrap, silk wrap thingy, and then wig cap. And for the hair itself, the hair is like super soft. I haven't had it in very long whatsoever. I missed a spot when I was flat ironing. So this is their straight 26 inch wig. I'm going to stand up for you all. I already know I missed a spot when I was flat ironing this. But I'm going to stand up for you all. It's pretty long. So I'm 5'7". Look at this. It goes like to the middle of my butt. And you all can see how it's flowing, how it's moving. Um, so far, the hair itself, I love it, love it, love it. It's going to take some getting used to a 5x5 five five closure. Like... Okay, y'all, my bad. My phone keeps falling. But, so my thing with really wild, like, 13 by 4 wig, like, wigs is because, like, I like to have the little sideburn area right there. Like, the only baby hair I really like to do is the temple, a little sideburn. But, um, with my edges being out over here, like, I could probably just gel that down and make a little sideburn if I wanted. But this hair looks really, really good, okay? And they weren't playing about this HD lace either. So I did, I did add like some lace tint. You all know this is like my go-to lace tint right now. I haven't tried too many of them, but right now I really like the EBN. That's just the way I say it. I don't know if that's how you're really supposed to say it, but um, let me bring all the hair to the front. But I wear the medium brown color. So my foundation shade is like 420 Infinity in Maybelline. In the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation is coconut. But y'all see like all of this luster, all this shine, like the length is there, like it's giving right now. So this is a really long 26 inch to me. Like this is where like some of my 30s be falling. I don't know if they, if this is just super long or if the, like I've been getting really short hair, so. I do have my measuring tape right here. So let's try it. Well, I'm just going to measure it from here. Let's measure it from here to here. Yeah, according to the measuring tape, when I measure from here to there, it's 28 inches. I would say the hair is very true to length. This is like, 
a really good um density too i believe it's only 180 percent density but the thickness is there to where like straight hair can get out of control if you get it too thick sometimes like if you really want like more of a flat look i think probably 180 percent for straight is really good now if you want like if we're talking like loose deep wave loose wave body wave now those i would go with 250 or 200 percent density but for straight i feel like you can get 180 and still be serving a look like look at this look at that but hmm i'm still i'm impressed with the five by five closure for this to be my first one um i like plucked it a little bit i could probably do a little more but it's like something that's it's so fast so if you're a beginner or like me, I install my wigs every day with Got To Be Glue Free Spray. But um, if you just don't want to take all day and you want it to look really good without a lot of work, definitely get a closure. Beginners, get a closure. If you're very <laughs> lazy, get a closure. But I, I think it does give like the impression of a frontal. So, like, look how good this lace looks. Like, it does kind of give the impression of a frontal, you know? Like, like, look at that. This lace really is HD, okay? Like, the lace tint definitely helped because it looked like a little yellowish. But adding lace tint makeup um, will really help it blend in more. Really, lace tint is better, but... Because makeup is ha usually has some kind of oil in it to where the oil will kind of interfere with your wig actually sticking on your head. So that's why lace tint is a little better than using makeup. But so far so good. I haven't had it in long at all. Once again, this wig is from Wig My. I'm going to link it in the description box. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you all have any other questions about the hair, put them in the comment section. You can DM me on Instagram at Madam Brittany or whatever. But I hope you all enjoyed this video. Thank you all so much for watching. Have a great day, you all. Bye.